test, 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 test. Hi guys, it's Rosa Arfnosi. So I figured it was about time for another update because there's a few things that I wanted to address. <clears throat> um, right, so with Limbo finished recording, uh, yes, it's actually finished recording, all I need to do is edit the rest of the pieces. They should be up in the next uh, next day or two. Um, you know, I'll be looking for another um, another game to play. And I already have quite a list already built up of some of the possible ones. I kind of like to do, uh, as you know, kind of like to do two different types of games at the same time. That way, uh, you know, if it, if one of them isn't somebody's uh, cup of tea, then they always have an alternative to watch at the same time, even if I have been kind of um, sl slowing down on the longest journey, simply because it is very time consuming and uh, laborious to record and edit most of the time. Uh, anyway, first thing I wanted to talk about is Minecraft, because I'm, I'm getting a lot of people who want more Minecraft. Minecraft, I haven't officially ended, simply because I, I ended it officially previously. Uh, some of you know that, who, who watched the whole series. I actually called it a closed, and then I just came back to it. Just inevitably, I will come back to Minecraft. To be perfectly honest, though, I just have not been in the mood to play Minecraft uh, I haven't been feeling it. I haven't been in the mood. So sorry about that. But um, you know, it's also in your favor because I'm I'm sure that the quality of my videos would be pretty decreased if I was forcing myself to play something that I didn't want to play. So when it does come back, as inevitably it will eventually, I'm gonna keep it ongoing. But it's going to be it will always be ongoing. But it's going to be very irregular. I'll, I'll come back to it eventually. Uh, secondly, um, let's see, let's see, let's see. So what do I have in store? I've been kind of keeping it a secret, but I guess now would probably be the time to go ahead and let it all out. A lot of people are requesting Portal 2. I'll be honest and say that I started recording Portal 2. I recorded ooh, a handful of, reco of, of videos for it, but then I stopped because I didn't know if I wanted to do it. Because, to be perfectly honest, um, Limbo, although it was a great game, I had a lot of fun recording it and playing it, and I enjoyed it a lot. That type of puzzle game, I get some very uh, annoying, obnoxious comments that uh, it just wears my patience. And Portal 2, I'm sure, will be exactly the same. Um, although, it might be a little bit easier as far as puzzles are concerned, than Limbo, maybe. So, perhaps. If there's a good chance, there's a chance. And secondly, what am I going to play after Limbo? Well, I'm going to replace Limbo with a co-op of Resident Evil 5, which has been underway for quite some time now. So it's pretty far progressed. So you can be most assured that that's going to be with. Who that co-op is going to be with? I guess you'll have to wait and find out. Next next on the list, uh, I'm also working on a series for Trauma, which is an indie game. I, I don't, darn it, I don't recall what country of origin it was developed in, but it is a very much like the path, but only not in mood and feeling and stylistically it's not the same, but the type of game that it is. It's more of an explorative storytelling uh, is what it is. There's not very much in the way of... Um, well, okay, there's nothing in the way of combat. You can go ahead and look it up. It's available on Steam. Uh, so I started that, but that's going to be, you know, a little while once I decide how I'm going to go about it. And then after that, I fully intend on playing Bioshocks 1 and 2. Yay! And there was applause all around. Um, so I've never played Bioshock 1 or 2, and I've heard really great things about it. I heard that it's basically a legend as far as video gaming's concerned, but I've never played it, and I just don't know why. But uh, when Steam had that wonderful, fantastic summer sale, I picked both of them up for extremely reasonable. 
if you guys don't have Steam, um, I would highly encourage you because even if you don't really like to game through uh, through Steam, they have some really good deals, really good um, sales occasionally, and you can get you could get games for like sixty percent off, seventy five percent off, fifty percent off, and that's really great. Another thing I wanted to just go ahead and put out in this video for those of you who missed it, my new puppy, the one I was talking about in Limbo, uh, I actually did go get her. I think that you can actually hear her barking in one of my, uh, one of my videos. But uh, I'm still getting a lot of questions. What's her name? I named her Lady. Uh, what type of dog is she? She's an Australian Shepherd. Um, she's really beautiful. She's got one. Uh, kind of greenish amber eye and the other eye is um, partially blue and partially green very beautiful she's extremely smart most of the time she's very mellow um, I've already taught her I've had her for a couple two weeks three weeks now maybe not even three weeks and I've already taught her several commands and she's very very close to being fully leash trained so I love her to death she's awesome first dog I've ever had and um yeah, maybe you'll be hearing some of her cameo <laughs> cameo interjections, you know, in some of the future games. Another thing I wanted to mention was I had several people recommend, highly recommend, Rule of Rose to me. And the moment that I Google searched it and found a short description about it, I thought, I have to play this game. I I had not heard of it, never nothing, and then uh, I watched the trailer for it, um, and it, it was amazing, and I thought to myself, where can I get this game? I am going to play this. I'm going to make a series out of it, because I love that kind of game. It doesn't look scary per se, but mostly creepy, and also it has my name in it. How awesome is that? The Rule of Rose. It is my rule, and... Unfortunately, very sadly and tragically, I cannot find it. I searched for it on, on uh, eBay and Amazon, and apparently it's a rare game. And uh, it was actually banned from the UK, so um, it, it is on eBay and Amazon, but extremely expensive. I think uh, new was going for $100. Uh, starting price and used was starting at forty dollars and which isn't too bad but uh you know forty dollars for what a, a almost ten year old game no eight eight year old game that's used i don't know how i feel about that maybe i'll get it in the future but right now i can't i looked into uh emulation for it but i don't i believe that um that game does not work in emulation so Un unless I can find a way around it, it looks like, you know, it's it's not going to be a possibility right now. And I'm very bummed out about it, because when I saw it, I got extremely excited. Ah, it's very, very unfortunate. So if any of you have any suggestions or any knowledge about that and might be able to help me out in that area, please feel free to send that to me. Um, 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 um. What else? Something I was going to say. Right. So if you guys have any questions, the next update that I'm going to make is going to be another FAQ. Because I haven't done one in a while. I've gained a lot of viewers since then. I think I'm at about 1,370, which is super exciting. Um, and, and I'm very happy about that. So, you know, any questions at all, uh, feel free to send them. They could be about me. They could be about what I like. They could be about how I record. How do I feel about certain games? How do I feel about certain subjects? Anything that you would like, as long as it's not, you know, they're not, as long as they're appropriate questions, of course. So, anyways, I think that that just about wraps it up, and I will see you guys in the games. Bye-bye.